Hello, hello, hello. Well, you want to see a grown man cry? Stick around. Because it's going to be a cold one tonight. Five degrees already. And it's only office four. Uh, it's due to drop down to minus two through the night. I'll be honest, it's the coldest I've ever slept outside in. So, uh, I'm not too sure what to expect. But, I've got a bit of gear tonight which hopefully should uh, see me through. So yeah, let's crack on. So this will show you how cold it is here. So, there's a little stream here, as you can probably hear. And we had snow last week. Uh, well, yeah, last week. It's all gone most places. But there is still some here. Got snow. Just realised that every night is snow. I think it's some kind of scum on the water. I won't be drinking out of that tonight. Right then. I haven't actually been able to record much, if any, to be honest. But, as ever, this is me tonight. Got the tarp up because it's due to drop down to minus two. I think I've already said that. Uh, so yeah, I got the tarp up so I don't freeze. Hopefully anyway. Uh, but yeah, I've got a bit of gear tonight, which will, uh, I've got a bit of gear tonight, which will uh, hopefully aid me in this cool weather. Cool weather. I mean, it's literally freezing. There is no cold weather, is it? It's literally freezing. But yeah, got a bit of, bit of gear with me tonight. Santa has been early, and it's this. This neoprene bag. Yeah, I'm only joking. It's uh, it's this. And this is it. I know it doesn't look like much, but uh, hopefully it's going to keep me nice and warm. So, it's a quilt. It's a down quilt. Um, if you've been here a while, you'll know that I make no... Uh, I don't know what that word is, but it's a pain in the arse getting into a sleeping bag inside a hammock. From underneath me. Oh. 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 Something like this. Oh. Hence why they make hammock quilts. So. Santa's brought me one. So, let's get it out. Let it do its thing. Let it puff up a little bit. Ooh. Yeah, so. That is what is gonna be keeping me warm tonight. Obviously it'll start to loft up, although it already has done a really good job actually. It's not been in the compression sack very long, it's only been in there about half an hour. I've been at work today so I've, uh, I've left it in its storage sack in the car. And I've only stuffed it in the stuff sack just when I got out of the car to come to hike up this hill. So... We could actually be in for a very long night tonight. So my power bank, my power bank has uh, has just died on me. So oh, it's going to be a long night again, isn't it? I had a long night the other week where I didn't have any phone battery. What is my phone currently on? Sixty-three percent. 
and it is oh, about quarter to six so i'm gonna have to conserve a bit of battery on i've got about four hours on let's be honest about four hours i need to i need a bit of battery for um Oh, that sound, well, it's sliding off. A mate of mine asked me the other week, he's like, why? Why do you go out all the time in, well, especially in cold weather? And to be honest, I work in an office. So, uh, as part of that, it does mean I get to work from home. I don't have to work from home, but I can. So I do two, three days a week from home. Um, generally always a Monday and a Friday from home. Meaning, oh, this is burning. Sugar. Oh, sugar. Got a bit of water in. Lovely. Watery mashed potato. Generally, I do Friday, Monday, Tuesday at home. So, I mean, obviously, then the weekend. So, to be honest, I'm quite outdoorsy. I don't really like being in. So when I'm doing like a Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday at home, I like to uh, I like to break it up and get out. To be fair. Yeah, I do a lot of midweekers, again, because just to sort of break up that mundane work, eat, sleep, work, eat, sleep. So, uh, so yeah, I mean, that's the reason I do it, to be fair, even this time. Of year. And to be honest, I genuinely, I genuinely in law, I, I love sleeping in a hammock. Um, I have one in my bedroom, but Kate won't let me. Uh, the kids have both got one in their room and obviously I sleep in the garden quite a bit as well you know I sleep in the garden quite a bit but don't actually publish it you know what I mean I don't, I don't record myself sleeping in the garden it's uh, I just do it because I enjoy it you know what I mean so yeah that if anyone else is wondering is the reason why I get out and I do this so often because I just enjoy it and uh, well yeah to get away from that mundane nine or five so to speak right and it's amazing Ooh. it's amazing how quick you fall asleep when you've uh, you've got no entertainment to keep you awake, like a TV or something to watch. So it's currently nine o'clock, and I just woke up. Only had half hour or so, I think. Uh, but yeah, oh, drop myself back up. So yeah, just been to the toilet and uh, to be honest, I'm going to go back to sleep, probably, because obviously I'm conserving battery life everywhere. So uh, yeah, I'm wish me luck. See you in the morning. Ooh. Good morning. <sighs> This is it's quarter past five. And according to my phone, it's minus one degrees. Well, minus one. So, uh, yeah, I'm not looking forward to getting out there, to be honest. Uh, slept all right. 
slept well actually. Oh, a little bit chilly from underneath. Must be expensive. Yeah, minus one. The battery's just gone dead again. So I've been through, I've been through three GoPro batteries and they've lasted minutes. So no longer, no idea how long this one's gonna last. It's 98% at the moment. So the other ones just dropped from 98% to zero in that long. Anyway, yeah. Not looking forward to getting up to be honest, because it, oh God, I can feel it in my hands. It is freezing out there. Obviously, it's a minus one. It's a bit of a stupid thing to say. Anyway. Oh. Yeah. Oh, I suppose I must do it now. Gotta get to work. Frost on the inside of the top. Yep. Condensation. That's frozen. What's the condensation that's frozen? How's my shoes looking? That'll be the test, wouldn't it? It'd be a bottle of water. Let me get up and have a look. I mean, water's not froze. Yep. Throws, throws, throws. At least the tree approves of me uh, being there. Not too sure how well that's coming across on camera. For the frost. But yeah, my hands are froze. I've got my heated gloves, but uh, I can't put them on because it's too bulky to put stuff away. Anyway, this is the last thing to put away. I'm gonna head back to the car. All right. Got my heated gloves going on. That's all packed away. You can't see nothing, can you? It's so difficult to make a video when it's dark and you arrive and dark and you leave. So bear with if you are still here. As ever, really appreciate it. Thanks very much. And uh, yeah, see you next week. Will I? Who knows? Like I say, it's too difficult to make a video, isn't it? If you want to see a video, I mean, I'll still be here. If you keep watching, I'll still be here next week. See you guys. Cheers. Oh God. Right, it's now half past one in the afternoon. Same afternoon. And I'm back. This is what it looks like. But yeah, I'm back because I forgot my trail camera. I remember when I got to work, I left it uh, strapped to the tree. Problem is, this place looks a lot different when it was dark. So I'm not really too sure where I was. So, uh, yeah, let's see if we can find it. Right, I'm back at the waterfall. That's the fall. Oh. 
There's all the scum I thought was snow. What an idiot. Anyway, to the camp. Yeah, in all the excitement this morning, wanting to get back to the car, obviously wanting to get to work. Yeah, I just nipped out my dinner hour. So, uh, um, I forgot to say, the blanket did me a solid last night. Really good. A little bit chilly underneath, to be honest. So I could probably do with doubling up the uh, underquilt for nights like that last night. Not gonna lie, I've never been this woodland before. Well, I have been this woodland before, twice. Both times, camped in the same place. I've just noticed loads of trees up there. I think uh, we might have to be back. Anyway, don't forget, like the video, leave me a comment, let me know where you're watching from, and uh, I will see you next week this time. Cheers, guys.